A friend of mine has this product called Game Power Profits, and when you go to the sales page for it, it loads this YouTube video and it starts automatically playing, and you hear it and whatever. And you click pause. Now, the interesting thing about this video is that it's actually running from YouTube, but there's no YouTube controls, there's nothing running around it. Uh, there's just this YouTube button. That's the only thing that stays on here, and that's you really have a hard time seeing it even, unless you're on a screen where it's a darker color over the top of it. So, um, this is my friend Joel Com. So, in any case, um, Joel's friends with a lot of people. But in any case, let's look at how they have done this on the sales page and see how you can also create an embeddable YouTube player that doesn't have controls around it. So, what we will do is go ahead and do a uh, source. See, what you can do is go view source. So, on this page, you'd go view page source, and that's going to pull up the page source for this. And then, what I'm going to do in here is do control F, that's going to pull up a search. And what I'm going to do is look for YouTube. And we get to this YouTube code here, and I'm going to pull this code out so we can actually see it. But it starts with this iframe here, and it ends with the iframe on the other end. So I'm going to copy that and put it into a Word document. Paste that into here. I've made this a little bigger so we can actually see what is going on here in the code. And what they've done, they've got the iframe code from YouTube and it's got the width and the height like we've shown in other videos. What they did here is they said the mode, so they've got the code right here for everything, right? That is the video embed choose to embed and embed this video right here that's the video ID behind that they put this question mark question mark W mode equals so that's the the viewing mode and you want it to be opaque and do you want it to show info if you want it to show info this would be a one but if you don't want it to show info you go zero and then they've got this and amp that's just an ampersand character which is actually this character here and then they've got colon autoplay equals one because they want autoplay to be on and then they've got controls equals zero so they don't want the controls and they've got modest branding equals zero so you'd want that code for modest branding that you can see what modest branding does in some of the other videos I've put up on YouTube here you can also see what controls do in some of the other videos I put up on YouTube but what they've done is they've set their controls to be zero they've set their modest branding to be zero and they don't want to show related videos they've turned related videos off at the end of the video one other thing they did is they put the frame border to zero and they even styled it to say if there is a border we want it to be zero pixels and we want it to be solid and we want it to be FFF or you could even go FFF FFF and what that means is white for all purposes FFF FFF is white so that means that the border that's around their video is going to be white. So to be geeky again one more time, they put the embed code in here, then this is the video ID. They put a question mark and they put the code W mode. So the W mode is opaque. They turned off the showing of the info. They turned off the autoplay. Sorry, they turned on the autoplay. They turned off the controls and they turned off the modest branding, turned off related videos, made sure their frame border was zero, and made sure that if it did show that it was going to be FFF or FFF FFF, which is white. And that is how they get a YouTube video to autoplay and have no controls visible other than just clicking to pause it. And that is how you do that if you are looking to embed a video that's going to run from YouTube on your own web page. My name is Jonathan Kraft. I made all of these YouTube videos about how to do things with YouTube videos on a web page. So go check them out. They are very interesting. And if you watch even half of them, you'll know more about embedding YouTube videos on web pages than anybody. Well, anybody who hasn't watched these videos. Enjoy. Seriously, check one of them out. I'll just, I'll just wait here. Really, they're, they're just right below. I'm just holding up my camera. Uh, seriously, just click on one of them, any of them. Really, pick one. They're all clickable. Just pick one, any of them. I'll just hang out.
If you liked this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up below. Be sure to subscribe as we have more helpful videos almost every single day. If you have any questions that we can answer for you, please be sure to come and visit us at showmehowtodothis.com.